What's up, y'all? I'm back at it again with another one. Today I'm be diving into some of the graphic design stuff I be doing for my clothing brand. I'm be showing y'all how I did some old mock-ups and stuff for um yeah for the website for the cream t-shirts, the classic ten street shirts. But yeah, before we go on diving into anything, though y'all go on and get this video a little light. Gonna subscribe. If you ain't subscribed, come be getting ain't this ain't gonna be doing nothing but getting better as it go. So gonna subscribe, stay tuned, stay updated. And yeah, let's get it. Alright y'all, so I'm gonna be showing y'all the most cost efficient ways to go about making y'all mock ups or whatnot and the way that I went about making mine. So the way that I had got the blanks, I had just went on Google. And just looked up like cream blank, like blank cream mock ups. And then I just had went on, I think it took me to a link to Adobe Stock or something like that. I don't know. But instead of just downloading it and having to pay for it and stuff like that, y'all can just screenshot it from your laptop if you got a MacBook or whatever. It's Shift Command 3. I don't know what it is for the other computers. But yeah, though. Screenshot that, get your mock-ups and uh, I'm putting my tags in on the mock-ups. Like I'm on um, digitizing that the way that I be doing my tags. Like they gonna look, they look like this anyway. But like for the website sake, I just had put the word size in there. See, I put size in there instead of an actual size for website sake. But shut up and getting everything crispy and lined up. And I'll show y'all how to, um, yeah, I'll show y'all how I design my tags too. If y'all wanna learn how to do that, get in there or not, yeah, y'all can comment, and let me know or not. But you know, ain't nothing to it. Then just get your blank mock-up pictures and crop them out real nice, however you want to, and just put them in Adobe Illustrator. Whenever you put them in Adobe Illustrator, you ain't gotta worry about nothing going blurry no more. So you be green zone. And if y'all want me to dog, I'm gonna show y'all how to get that Adobe Illustrator. Just drop a comment or whatever. Me personally, now I pay for my Adobe Illustrator, but I only pay like twenty dollars a month for it because I'm on like a student plan. So if you a student, like if you a student, any college or whatever, like if you, even if you in high school and got college classes, you can do this. Like just go on Adobe and now uh, go and register with your college or whatnot. And you will be straight. And it's about twenty dollars a month. But you know, it's three ways to go about this too. Yeah. But you're know, gonna comment with now y'all want me going on getting that. But you know, now I'm adding um, yeah, I'm adding my logo on now. Yeah, adding the front logo on there. About the size that it's gonna be. Whenever I'm sizing down, I'm making sure that I'm um, holding and shift whenever I do it, so it'll keep the same shape. But just size down to um, what it look like in real life. Yup. Y'all seeing it kind of like? Alright, bitch. Alright, so now I'm about to do the back of the t-shirt now. Alright, in the back, I used the quote. It's a longer quote though, but I had typed in Google Docs prior to this though. Alright, so I'm about to go to Google Docs and I'ma just copy and paste that and I'ma show y'all how to do all that though. Alright, and I made sure that I formatted it right and everything. Like this the way that it's gonna be formatted whenever it's on the back of the shirt. Y'all gotta make sure all that stuff be right too. Alright, so they just go there, you copy and paste it. Whatever you copy and paste it in there, it's going to give you a default font and a default, damn, default color. But you're just going to change all that up. And the font that I'm using for this is Babies. Yo, so I'm just sizing that up how it's going to look in real life. And if you enjoying everything so far, go on and leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss a beat on any future videos. And follow the Instagram page so you don't miss a beat on the polls and no updates at all. And I'm about to go to add the last little piece on this. A little signature. Yes, sir. 
Alright, see, you ain't that hard, y'all. Um, graphic design, what I want. I also offer markup services and everything to on my graphic design page. I'll leave the link to that below too. But yeah, don't forget to subscribe and like. I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Peace. Shut up! You're killing me, Smalls.